All right, guys, version 3.3.21 is a manual upgrade. It is not an automatic update. So what I suggest, if you do not want to lose your data from the prior version, that you go into your online lead finder, into your settings, and you will find a backup and restore um, link, and you will save your data to your backup folder, Okay, and um, that is how you make a backup, all right, from your previous data. So now we're going to update to the new version. So I'm going to um, close this down here. Let me just clear out my screen here. And I'm going to my programs. And I am going to go to my online lead. The installer, yes, and there's my online lead finder program itself, uninstall, yes, and I'm going to scroll down to my SQL uh, database um, install, and we'll say SQL.data, SQLite, and we're going to uninstall that, and we'll say yes. See these black boxes come up? All right, it was removed from our computer. Now, you're going to have your data set that you downloaded from the site, and you're going to right-click on it, say Extract All. It's going to unzip the fo uh, file to a folder. You will run the ms.msi. And it's going to open up some black boxes here. Don't worry. Do not close anything down. Just walk through the wizard. You want to make sure here that you install the assemblies into the global assembly cache. All right. You must check this box. All right. Now we press install. You're going to see black boxes for a while. Let it compile itself. This is a major update. Everything is going fine. Just let it update. Do not close anything. Just let those black boxes work. We are installing a new database structure. This is perfectly normal. Does take some time. Don't worry, don't cancel anything out. We are compiling the new database. This install process will take you upwards to five minutes to do. I'm running this in real time so you know that it takes a while. All right, now you do not have to view the README file, so you can uncheck that and press finish. Now we're getting to install the online lead finder where it says it's complete. Now you can close this down. Okay, your new desktop icon is here. All right, remember we made a back we made a backup of our information here. So we're going to press online lead finder. You'll see that's the version 3.3.21, which is totally new. Now, because this is a complete new uninstall, you still have to enter your license keys from the prior version. So, what we can do here is if you do not have your registration keys handy, you can always use your backup file where they are. So, we're going to cancel that out. 
it will open up the main screen and you'll see that it's a trial version all right so what we want to do is go back to our settings menu to our backup and restore menu we are going to restore the, the data from a previous backup file okay there's our backup file from the previous version we press open and then we say yes we want to restore and just wait a few minutes it has been restored successfully okay.